Man, I just want to tell you guys something real quick. I got a friend of mine that's currently sitting in the county jail over a female. Now, this ain't like some woman hating video or nothing. But I just want to make it a point, guys, by the way. It's actually it's a pretty nice day outside today. That's a hot tub that we're fixing. Ah, it's crazy news, man. How you... One of the things you really should think about, man, is if you're in a relationship and that relationship causes you to be arrested. He didn't like hit her or nothing like that. It's nothing serious. It's just some childish drama between the two. And this is the second time, no, third time now, that he's in jail because of some stupid, stupid stuff. And the question is, is, if it gets that bad, why even continue with it? Like, why even, matter way, it's my TV. Just sitting out here in the living room watching some TV and stuff, and I thought about it. Why even let things get to that point, man? Why even... I, I, I guess I just don't understand it. Like, if things get to that point where things are hostile, and again, you're not, like, beating each other up or nothing, or arguing, Why? Just leave. Just leave. Just don't, like, who has time to deal with that? I know for sure I don't. I have zero time to deal with any of that. And that's why I enjoy being by myself. I don't have to answer to nobody. I don't, like, when I dropped all that weight, there was a female that came to me. She rejected me when, like, years ago, when I was bigger. And then she's like, well, she's like, we should talk again. No, I don't have time for that. I don't have time for that. I got time for me. I got time for my family, my loved ones, man. I don't have time to be, be, be kind of trying to, um, you know, be what other people want me to be so that they can accept me. That's not what I have time for. And... <laughs> And I don't have, you know, and, and, and I also don't have time to go to jail because, because of, of an argument. This is stupid. This is stupid, man. And for any of you guys that are in this kind of situation, I advise you to think about it. Besides family, like blood family, let me ask you a question. Is anybody worth going to jail over? And the answer is hell no. The only way I'm going to jail is if you hit me, if you hit a family member of mine, if you threaten a family member of mine to include pets, or if you break in my house. If you break in my house, I got something for you, bro. You're not leaving alive. If you come to my house looking for a fight and you come at me, just know they're, you ain't leaving alive. But those are the few times in, in Colorado, even if it's... Uh, even if it's self-defense, you do one like you do get arrested. So like if I got into a firefight with somebody, like somebody came in with a gun and I got mine and you know I shot and killed them, killed them. At first, yes, you do go to jail. You do go to jail. Um, by the way, I never got to show you guys the upstairs from the. Uh, you know, here you go. We got all the drywall done now. All the drywall, all the electrical, all that stuff is done from the fire. Ah! So now we're um, fixing the kitchen, got all new appliances and everything, all new floor, all kinds of stuff. It's a uh, it's work, you know, it's a work in progress, but it's happening. But, 
Um, so next, and we got all new windows and everything too. Uh, next we're, that was a top of shift by the way. Uh, I'm gonna be doing all the painting and stuff and getting all that stuff done. It's gonna be looking nice here soon. Insurance money took forever to come in. So, yeah. But anyway, um, it's not really worth going to jail over. Like, I just don't understand it, man. Like, your, your concern should be your family. And, and stuff like that. Like, you should never get to a point where things are, you're willing to go to jail over an argument. Worry about you, worry about your money, worry about your, your house, your family, all those things, man. Your health. Now, all that childish stuff, all them arguments over dumb stuff, man, that's for the birds, dude. That is for the birds. Don't allow someone else to control how you lead your life and how you live your life. That's what I'm saying. Later.